So with the introduction of these biologically targeted agents for cancer therapy, we are encountering a whole new series of toxicities in the mouth, skin, other parts of the body. Uh, some of the toxicities that we've seen associated with agents in the mouth include uh, mucositis-like lesions. So for example, with the mTOR inhibitors, we see aphthous-like or canker sore-like uh, lesions that from a patient standpoint are similarly painful and have the same type of impact. But from the clinician standpoint, they present in a quite different way and we actually can manage them quite differently. Um, however, there are also toxicities where we don't see any clinical findings at all. Um, and these have actually been a, a lot more challenging and still to date are really not very well defined. Um, so in particular with some of the multi-targeted um, tyrosine kinase inhibitors or TKIs, what we've actually seen is a toxicity reported as stomatitis, but where the patients actually have no clinical findings at all. So they have pain, for instance, a burning sensation of the tongue, yet the tongue does not have ulcerations or any type of abnormalities. So there's clearly a lot of work that still needs to be done in just characterizing and figuring out the best ways to manage these toxicities. Thank you.